Today, Shelly and I are headed to outer space. We're gonna get suited up. COVID's on this planet. We're leaving it. We're going to a new planet where they don't have it. <laughs> what an amazing experience. We were just blown away with our visit to the planetarium. If you love learning about the universe and the Incas, this experience is for you. Hi, my name is Ana Maria. I'm in charge of the Cusco's Planetarium, uh, what I define as the best job ever, yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's an amazing uh, tiny place in the middle of the Andes, in the Incas capital, Cusco. And here we decided to make what is now, now, uh, now as an interpretation center to talk to you about something that we cannot handle with our hands but surround us, like the force, <laughs> that is the universe. Yeah? We wanted to approach the local people to science uh, through the most wonderful gate that is astronomy. Anna Maria and her team actually picked us up on the night of our private tour and drove us out to their site. They are only doing private tours right now by appointment. This is uh, our interpretation center. We got the participation of a couple of wonderful artists. Uh, for example, in this panel that we got a beautiful drawing that allowed us to make the speech about why the ancient and then people wanted to see the sky. We got some also wonderful pictures here. And to get inspired about the universe, we got a second beautiful piece of art of one of the most talented uh, local artists, that is Vic Grobio. He's a tattoo artist and <laughs> a painter. So we make the speech like half an hour here and then make a little walk through this to get inside our dome. One of the most magical parts of the experience is a guided star tour in their dome. Lean back in your seats while Anna Maria casts the night stars above your head. Then like magic, she walks you through both the Incan and the Greek astronomy, making the constellations come to life. Did you know every place in the world has their own unique view of the universe? Prepare to be wowed. The team's passion for what they do is contagious. The second portion of the presentation dives into the history of the Incas, their connection to the universe, and how they use the stars. Even the eye of the puma, it's a rounded construction called Muyumarca, that we have another panel over there, that was used to fill it with water for observation of the stars. So imagine the puma reflecting in their eyes the sky. For the Incas, remember the sky was used for making calendars. No clocks, no cell phones in those days. So we still need to make we won't spoil the presentation for you by showing you too much, but you will learn so much during this portion. This was an excellent introduction to the Incas before visiting Machu Picchu. Next up, it wouldn't be a trip to the planetarium without seeing their amazing equipment for stargazing. The telescopes. This is a 10 inches telescope. So this is wonderful for deep space objects like nebulas, like some double star systems, some for, for planets are also, is also quite great. And also for the moon, yeah? The other one that we got here, the big equipment is a Skywatch. It's, a, it's wonderful because it's two inches bigger than this. So the details that we got with planets is amazing. We got other two, the little ones, a Celestron, uh, eight inches big. Uh, and uh, astronomical binocular that are also great because with this equipment for example i take a nebula and it's too close it's too zoom so i cannot appreciate the whole nebula yeah so for those the astronomical binocular that we got is amazing they saved the best for last as the tour ends with a trip outside to stargaze through their telescopes Seeing the constellations and stars as the Incas viewed them truly ties you to the people and makes you feel closer to everything you just learned. We cannot recommend this experience enough. 
And if people want to find out more about the planetarium, yes. even though they're not here in Cusco, yes. what's the best way for them to do that? Um, our website. We got our website. It's very easy. It's planetariumcusco.com. Into the wild again. Tell me when does it end? Hot under the shadow, the shadow of the morning. Into the break of dawn. If you like this video, please be sure to like and subscribe.